Very good. Thank you so much, Pearl. Well, kids do face a lot of challenges yep. these days, but a really unique program is trying to help. Yeah, so this is interesting. The program actually uses horses as teachers, yeah. and Cynthia is learning all about it. It's really cool how animals and kids can really relate to each other. It's amazing the kind of breakthroughs that you can make by having horses involved with kids. And Carolyn's here to tell us more. How did this whole program get started? It actually started with Carrie at uh, the Strathmore Agricultural Society. She went out for some training there and basically they didn't have the facilities to keep everything going. So she built this amazing arena that's heated, <laughs> yes. which is always lovely here. <laughs> and uh, we've basically been able to start up the program from there and work with the Siksika um, Medicine Lodge as well as the high schools, which we have here today. Oh, and wonderful. Here. Oh, you got to tell me what's going on over here. Uh, the horse this is like. This is uh, Jordy. He just kind of does that with this group. He just needs to roll it over. I feel he's, like he's, he's getting some. a roll. Yeah. <laughs> and they need to, the kids need to learn how to deal with that while yep. they're doing the training. Yep. Yeah. We've just got our big puppy. <laughs> <laughs> so right now comes. they're doing, they're working together with the horses and learning just to be patient with them. Absolutely, as well as uh, the objective today is focus. So they're really focusing on everything that they're doing. But I mean, Jordy's obviously going to throw a wrench in that for us. But tell, <laughs> tell me about these horses. They're rescue horses, aren't they? Uh, a lot of them we've gotten from different places, and they always have a little bit something different about them. Like Jordy, our guy who was just rolling over there, he actually had his ear partially bitten off by a stallion. Oh my. Um, so I. I guess he didn't get that lady friend, but uh, <laughs> he was a stallion up till quite a few years ago. JR, uh, right in front of us here as well, she was a mom for a bunch of years, so uh -huh. she has had tons and tons of babies. And uh, past two, all of our guys have a story. And and how about the class? Tell us about these kids. These kids are from the Sixth Second Nation High School, and they are a fabulous group of kids who are here for a number of different reasons, but they're all building self-esteem, the essential skills for them to continue and be really successful in their lives. And uh, yeah, we have a blast with them every time, so well, we're yeah. lucky for them to come out. <laughs> what fun, and then they get to come here for, I think it's 12 weeks. Yes, yeah. And, and start build all those skills all the time. Thank you yeah, so much for all of us. Thanks for coming out. So what a great program, and lots of different kids uh, from around Southern Alberta get involved. That is such a great program. Great program, that. Okay. Yep.